and welcome back to the most amazing channel on the internet. I'm your host Rebecca Felgate, and today we're talking about the top 10 shocking reality TV show scandals. Why? Because you bet that where there is a camera rolling, there is a scandal waiting to be unearthed. Now, before we jump into this video, let me know what your favorite reality show is and whether you would like to watch a reality TV show revolving around Land and Danny and my lives. It'd be crazy, I don't even know what we should call it, like most amazing lives. Also, if you guys want to meet us in the flesh, we will be at Playlist Live in Orlando from the 27th of April, so come and join us there. Also, don't forget to leave this video with a thumbs up and check out our merch. All of that is in the description box down below. Okay, let's get into it. Coming in at number 10, we have The Biggest Loser Lost Too Much Weight. If you haven't seen the TV show The Biggest Loser, it's basically an American TV show that pits overweight contestants against one another on their weight loss journey. Usually, the show contestants try to lose weight in a healthy and sustainable way. Way, but the season 15 winner, Rachel Fredrickson, dropped 155 pounds down to weigh in at a scary 105 pounds. Judges Gillian Michaels and Bob Harper were shocked at her transformation, which showcased the biggest weight loss in the show's history. Many people watching called Rachel's progress unhealthy, something that she later admitted to. A lot of people saw this as glamorizing an eating disorder. Coming in at number 9, we have Rosalyn has an affair with a crew member on The Bachelor. Uh oh. So the idea of The Bachelor is for a group of ladies to vie for the attention of an eligible, you know, bachelor. In 2010, Rosalind Papa was called out on air for having an affair with one of the show's producers. Show host Chris Harrison televised a conversation with the young mum, calling the affair embarrassing for the show, and he also said that the member of the crew in question had been fired. Awkward. Coming in at number 8, we have the time Portia slapped Kenya on The Real Housewives of Atlanta. A brawl on reality TV always causes a stir, and things really escalated in 2014 on the Real Housewives of Atlanta set. Basically, Kenya accused Portia of cheating on her husband. There was a large degree of hair pulling and slapping and dragging, which of course is not okay on TV. Whilst Portia was removed from the show for the episode, controversially neither her nor Kenya were fired. Coming in at number 7, we have Toddlers and Tiara's Prostitute Scandal. In the popular TLC show Toddlers and Tiara's, the show caused outrage when a mum, Wendy Dickey, dressed her three-year-old daughter Paisley in a pretty woman costume. Of course, the costume in question was mimicking one worn by Julia Roberts, who of course played a prostitute. Now, is it okay to dress a three-year-old as a prostitute in knee-high boots and a miniskirt? No, no it's not. ABC's Sherry Shepard spoke out against the episode, saying, Your job is to protect your child. If you don't think paedophiles are watching the show, I have a bridge I want to sell you. Coming in at number 6, we have the time Here Comes Honey Boo Boo was cancelled. Honey Boo Boo Child was a controversy onto herself from the very beginning when she debuted in the public eye on Toddlers and Tiaras. But obviously, with controversial figures comes ratings, and eventually the toddler and her family were awarded a TV show of their very own. In 2014, after a two year run, the show was cancelled when it was revealed that the mum, June Shannon, was dating a man on the sex offenders register. Mark Antony was convicted of aggregated child molestation with an eight year old, which is pretty darn disgusting. Despite having a whole seasons worth of content ready to go, the show was pulled and six months of content went unaired. Coming in at number 5, we have Coughgate on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire. Back in 2001, Mark Ingram won £1 million on the British TV show Who Wants to Be a Millionaire, but actually, it turns out he cheated. Using his wife, Diana, and his friend Tequin Whitock, Ingram devised a coughing scheme wherein his accomplices would signal which way he should answer. After all of the fanfare of winning, he was found out. He was then ordered to give the money back, fined, and given a prison sentence. Awkward. He later appeared on Wife Swap with Jade Goody, who is coming in next for a scandal of her very own. But before we get there though, I thought I would mention that Chappy Boy tripped on an apple whilst mowing the lawn in 2010 and sliced off three of his toes. Yikes. Okay, back to Jade Goody, who caused a serious stir in 2007 with her racist remarks in the Big Brother house. Now that's all coming into number four. So Jade Goody found fame in 2003 when she appeared on the British outpost of the regular Big Brother. She she won over her audience with her seemingly sweet but totally dumb persona. Fast forward four years and she is back on Big Brother, this time the celebrity edition, and this time she's not just dumb, but she's a dumb, dumb racist. She and co contestants Joe O'Meara and Danielle Lloyd garnered 44,500 complaints for their racist comments towards Shilpa Shetty. They called her a packy and dubbed her Shilpa Poppadom, which is 
absolutely not acceptable. This led to international outcry with the then Prime Minister of England Gordon Brown condemning the show. Jade died of cervical cancer 2 years later. Coming in at number 3, we have 17 year old Harry Styles dating 32 year old Caroline Flack after an X Factor appearance. One Direction superstar Harry Styles caused a media storm when he was spotted leaving the Extra Factor presenters London apartment after appearing on the show. There are a lot of raised eyebrows at the age gap with Flack being 15 years older than the pop star. The relationship ended when Flack started getting Twitter death threats. Coming in at number 2, Johnny Fairplay lied about a dead grandmother on Survivor. Johnny was everything other than a fair player on Survivor in 2003 when his friend Dan came to visit him in a family and friends episode. Johnny asked how his grandma was doing and Dan said, she died dude. Johnny gained a whole load of sympathy from the audience and his fellow contestants. Now This secured his place amid the last 7, but it all turned out to be a disgusting lie. Horrendous, who does that? Finally, a disgusting scandal that brought down a 7 year television dynasty, we have the Josh Duggar sexual abuse scandal. This was all coming from 19 Kids and Counting. Now, 19 Kids and Counting was a popular reality TV show from 2008 to 2015. It was cancelled in light of a sex scandal. In May 2015, a police report from 9 years prior was published in the Touch Weekly magazine. The report detailed sexual molestation allegations against 5 underage girls. Girls, including four of his sisters. The report said that he touched their breasts and genitals whilst they were sleeping, and in some really, really horrible cases, whilst they were awake as well. The case was not fully investigated as the statute of limitations had expired. TLC cancelled the show and removed all reruns. So, that was the top 10 shocking reality TV show scandals. Which do you think was the most shocking? Let me know in the comments section down below. Also, don't forget to find out more about Playlist Live if you want to meet us. Guys, I've been your host Rebecca Felgate, please do leave this video with a good thumbs up, share with a friend and stay subscribed for more most amazing videos. Bye! <laughs>